hi guys welcome to this video and today's video as you got to know from the title it's a paycheck budgeting video for the month of april and also i'll try to do the cash stuffing as well for uh, this month so let's just get started this time uh, again while i was shooting you know while mentioning that each my allocation of the money there was a big noise in the background for which i have to reshoot this video again uh, i have already mentioned the amount and so what i'll do i'll just take you through so that it is faster and then we will head on to cash stuffing so my income for this month is the same my fixed expenses rent is the same school fee has gone up a lot <laughs> and i don't know till when like you know every year this is the situation and let's see till how long we can sustain like this so you know i really pity it's just if we have one child and then the cost of education is just going up how people with you know with two three childs how are they going to manage i really a government should do something about this then we have electricity bill 4000 same domestic is the same and money allotted family i'm allotting 5000 my this is my personal loan so which is going to get over in august so i'm very excited that i will be ending this this year Airtel is getting this is the broadband then toll and car wash is getting this much tennis is 750 from both of us me and my husband so 1500 in total so this we are pausing for this month and next month because the weather is we're getting very hot now uh, and the timings are not suiting us so maybe after two months we will try to enroll like you know restart our son's classes so what I'm going to we are allotting this money in his pocket money so i'll come back to this later petrol i am giving allotting 5000 grocery is the same beauty i'm allotting 3000 car service and insurance is 1000 pocket money so this is where rather than you know putting this anywhere else we are just giving putting it in his envelope household is not getting anything miscellaneous is getting 1000 birthdays are not getting anything i will try to put it from the rollover money in the savings challenges gifts is 1000 dining out 500 amazon 1000 donation 1000 medical is 1000 because of the last month expense i am going to try to build a 5000 fund asap so 1000 clothes play zone and business are not getting anything in when it comes to savings SIPs, these are my SIPs which I am allotting this month as well. RDs, this is the recurring deposits automatically gets transferred. So this is for the policy, this is for my provident fund, this is for my emergency fund, this is for my other insurances and this is for my travel. So you know what I was doing for the provident fund that I used to keep one year of SI uh, RD and then transfer in the year end to provident fund but then now I realized as I am also learning all these investments and all so that if I am going to transfer every month I will get better interest rate so this time I am even though I mentioned I will be mentioning in RDs I will be transferring it manually every month it's a hassle for me but if I get better interest rate, why not? So I'll also check halfway through how the interest rates are showing. So I'll keep you posted on that. One of the viewers, she was asking me that what SIPs do I, uh, in which funds do I invest in SIPs? So basically I have a fund manager and he usually does, uh, he suggests the funds. But uh, now these days, very recently I came across uh, uh, one of the very famous YouTuber, uh, if you just go and check out his uh, channel, um, he's Akshat Srivastava and I follow him. Basically, he has been talking a lot about SIPs and what funds you should be investing. I like the way he explains. He has uh, spoken in one of his videos about index funds. So I'm planning to move some of my funds to index funds. So I will be doing this. I'm no financial advisor guys and this is just what I'm doing I'm uh, telling you all so you make your own judgments make your own research and then you invest your money so fixed expenses is coming up to this much sinking and variable expenses and savings so now I'll just total it and see whether it is okay or not or I have to adjust it somewhere 
so I'm over by 474 rupees obviously I have to do it in the variable expenses so miscellaneous I will allot only 500 yeah I think I should be okay now and then I'll make it as 250 so now let's see okay so that's still okay there will be some amount in my bank account which is all right this is pretty okay so let's just head to cash stuffing i'll just set up and come back so i'm back with the money and let's just get started with the stuffing i am stuffing 7500 so let's just count and see 1000 2000 3000 4000 5000 6000 7500 so beauty is getting 3000 one two and three so I'm trying to see if I can save something so that I can get something for the rollover car maintenance is getting 1000 let's just see how much we have from before so this is 1000 this. this is 1000 so we have 1000 two three four five 5,500 and 700 and 5,730 so I'm adding 1,000 so 6,730 so I am planning to see if I can you know build this fund till 12,000 so that I have ample amount for insurance and the servicing so after that I think I'll stop building this so let's see NIF is getting 1,500 I haven't been able to get him to this but I will make him down once I get some time so so I'll just mention here so I'll just mention tennis 1500 so earlier he had 3100 plus 1500 4600 So this is 1500, it's getting 1500, 2000, 2000, 3000, 4000, 500, and 600. So this is net done. Then we have household is not getting anything, miscellaneous is just getting 500. I paid cash so not getting anything Amazon is getting 1000 but this I'm going to transfer this online so that I am done with this you know uh, with the minus negative uh, amount that I have so this is deposit of 1000 which will bring to so I think by next month I will be done with it so I'm transferring this amount to my savings where I use this money, <laughs> my big splurge. Dining out is getting 500. Medical is getting 1000. So this is 1000. Then clothing business are not getting anything so this was all about the cash stuffing guys so I have some plans of some new binders uh, to start some sinking funds so please stay tuned for the next video and I will be soon catching up so till then bye take care